And that the, the Google business profile, it's interesting that a lot of people wouldn't normally think how important that is right out of the gate, right? What That's is the true. importance of the Google business profile before you go into your story? The biggest part of it is Google has provided a free location for you to list everything about your business. What you do is when they do a search, if, you can, if they can provide you the information without clicking off of Google, then you get more weight. So by using your Google business profile and updating it with everything you can possibly think of about your business and then adding a photo or a question or something like that once a week, Google sees you're engaged. They'll give you more weight in the searches, in your local searches. So that's really the big part of it. People only think of it as a place to store reviews and it's so much more and so much more powerful. You want to be on the top three of the map pack and you don't have to have the most reviews to be in that top three, which is what it used to be, but it, it's not that anymore. If you have any question, even the question of how, where can I get a, a birthday cake made? You're going to search Google for it. So if you're a local bakery, you want to make sure that everything you do is in your Google business profile. There's even three categories. Most people only think of one, like lawyers. A lot of the times we'll put lawyer. Okay. But if I'm searching for, say, an immigration lawyer or a family lawyer doesn't tell me enough. If I'm a bakery and I do birthday cakes, maybe I want to add that as my second or third category. So it's so much more. And just those little additions can make your phones ring, get more people to your website, and get more people to your location because you're, you can get directions. What would you say is the secret to people who do the best with their Google business profile. You can tell us, pretend we're having a coffee and we're best <laughs> friends. Just tell me what's a secret to the best business profile. I think that there's two really big important secrets that I pe think people just don't realize. And that is photos and videos. And that's one, I got another one. Photos and videos are very important. If you have a business that say uh, services a certain area, you've got a truck with a name on it, something like that, or you do deliveries, or you live in a, a town that has some landmarks, go out and take selfies out near the landmark. What that does is it location services, it geofences your photo. So when you upload it to Google Business Profile, it tells Google that you're relevant further than a mile away from your office or your business, right? And especially if you've got trucks with signs on the side, vans, any of that sort of thing, take pictures at the job site. So that would be the first thing I would do. Pictures and videos, absolutely. The other one is going to be questions and answers. So there's always a Q&A section on your Google Business Profile. So if you think of that about your FAQs, what are the top, say, 10 frequently asked questions that all of your customers or most of your customers have, right? We all have FAQs. So if you say once a week, you put a question and an answer up, Google's going to see that you're constantly engaging with your Google Business Profile. And then when people go to Google and ask a question, there's a possibility that your Google business profile will come up and your question, if it answers the question. Those are two really great hacks. I love it. <laughs> I didn't realize either of those, but I did notice because I do have a Google business profile that you do get a really nice report at the mm -hmm. end of the month. That is pretty cool because it shows how many people engaged with your Google business listing and even how many people search for directions to your location, which I thought was a pretty cool insight for, for business owners, right? Exactly. If you go into the insights or do manage your Google business profile, in the insights, it's, it tells you all of that. How many people clicked on the click to call? There's also the Google chat. So you can actually, if you've got a cell phone for your business that can accept text messages, you can put that in there. And then when people chat with you directly from Google, they're chatting directly with you in real time. Thanks so much for these insights. I think you have an offer for listeners if they want to learn more about some of these strategies. I do. Based on some of my experience, I wrote a book called uh, The Google Business Profile Training Guide. This is to help you step-by-step -step claim it, verify it, and, and then optimize it so that you can dominate your local searches. And you can find that book at MaximizeYourGBP.com. And for your listeners, I've got a, a coupon so they can get the book for only $5. And that coupon is 5Remarkable. Awesome.